We need some luck, some other spacecraft, something, because with what we have now, it's going to be finished. As an astronaut, you feel excluded to a particular group of people, and uh, those are the people which have the majority. They are you, not being aware of the danger in which you live. But now suppose I'm going to change all of you. Suppose I can transfer the experience which I have to, to you. Then you would go out and see the earth and you would see the blue sky. Not the blue sky which you see when you're outside. The space you see that you're the only one. You're the only planet. You have no spare, and so you have to take care of this one and only planet. Our Earth has cancer. I have cancer too. And most people with cancer, they die. But in fact, <laughs> everybody will die. But we make enough people to continuously survive mankind on the Earth. We need to conserve our own planet. And you, when you have, like say, the spirit and the, and the insight and the attitude of an astronaut, you start to love the Earth in a way other people can't. And if you really love something, you don't want to lose it. You know, my wife, <laughs> she doesn't want to lose me. She wants to do everything, so she has to stay alive. That's the love and attitude which humankind should get to the earth. 50% of our roofs covered with solar. We do not have more than half of our cars electric. We certainly do not have a production in which there is a reasonable amount of material recycled. We don't have all these things. And then the question comes, okay, well, what's wrong? But what's wrong is the mindset. I am sure, but I can't claim it. But when I heard 18 April 2013, that I had a very bad cancer, damn kidney cancer, and also changed into a sarcopathy, which means that, you know, it just slipped through all kinds of things. And, and the doctor, beautiful doctor in Houston, said, you have a fair amount of time. And of course, each time I asked, he said, what does fair mean? And then he was not very accurate, but he said, well, months, maybe a year. I got over a year. And a good year because I believed there's a good future and I believed, you know, you, you can do things with, with the power, with the mind power. We, we people coming from the same molecules out of one bloody strong star which bursted out. We, who have developed over billions of years, life. Life is made by we, we humanity, are so strong that we can save the earth, but we also can destroy it. Even a small thing does something.